Welcome to Zoho Sales IQ. This video will tell you how to enable push notifications for your Zoho Sales IQ mobile app. Inside the Zoho Sales IQ portal, navigate to Settings, Websites, Live Chat for Mobile Apps, Android, Advanced Settings and Enable Push Notifications. The next field will be the FCM Key field. If you have already generated your FCM key, in the Firebase console, navigate to Project Overview, Project Settings, Cloud Messaging and then copy the Legacy Server key and paste it inside the FCM key field and save. Otherwise, you need to generate the FCM key. The FCM key is a server key that authorizes your app server for access to Google services, including sending messages via Firebase Cloud Messaging. You can click on the link in our user guide to set up the FCM service. To set up Firebase and the FCM SDK, click Add Firebase to your Android project. Click on Add Project. Name your project and the project ID will be automatically generated. Click Create Project and then Continue. Your project will now be created. Now, Choose Add Firebase to your Android app option. The Android package name will be your application ID. Then, provide an app nickname and click register. The next step is downloading the Google Services.json file, which is the configuration file. Inside Android Studio, switch to Project and then drag and drop the JSON file inside the app folder. Navigate back to the Firebase console and click Next. The following step will be adding your Firebase SDK. Copy paste the code inside the project level build.gradle file. Then Include the following lines of code in the app level build.gradle file. Click on Sync Now. Once the build runs successfully, Click Next in the Firebase console. The final step is running your app to verify installation. Choose the deployment target and run the build. Firebase will be successfully added to your app. Remember that we have to enter the FCM key under Advanced Settings in your Sales IQ portal. This will now be possible since we have added Firebase to our app. In the Firebase console, navigate to Project Overview, Project Settings, Cloud Messaging, Copy the legacy server key and paste it inside the FCM key field and save. Now, we have added the FCM key to the Sales IQ portal. Following this, you need to add the FCM dependency to your app level build.gradle file. Copy paste it inside the code and click Sync Now. As the next step, Create a new Java class extending Firebase Messaging Service. Here, you will have to override two methods. The on new token callback is invoked whenever a new token is generated. The parameter has to be set to true to enable push notifications for the app. The next method is called on message received. Every time a notification is sent, this method gets invoked. Implement the Zoho SalesIQ.notification.handle API to broadcast SalesIQ notifications to your user. Then, copy paste the following code in your app manifest file. Register my Firebase messaging service class in Android manifest.xml. Choose the deployment target and run the build. Once the build runs successfully, reload the Zoho Sales IQ page and you will be able to see 
all the registered mobile devices inside your sales IQ portal. Enter a test message and send. The notification will show up on the test device. Thus, push notifications will be enabled for your Zoho Sales IQ mobile app. It is ideal that you set the test device to false and enable push method when it is production ready. I hope you found this video informative. Thank you.